Hello everyone, I am Dr. Danish Salim. There are certain precautions that needs to be taken after vaccination. Vaccination is a process of producing antibodies in our body. It's not a medicine or any other kind of remedy or magic. The weakened version of the virus is injected into the human body so that the body produces the antibody against the infection. Our body needs to follow certain precautions after getting vaccinated. Vaccination produces antibodies in the body unlike normal medicine that get broken down in the stomach before getting into action. So when the vaccination is injected in the human body, the body treats it as a threat or a pathogen and produces the antibody against it. As a result, in future, uh, it gains the capacity to fight against the COVID infection. Since live virus is not injected, we do not contract any disease. There are certain precautions to be taken care for few days after getting vaccinated. First, do not consume alcohol for at least 4 to 5 days. Alcohol causes dehydration which might hinder a healthy process going on in the body. Normally, when someone gets a, a fever, doctor advises the patient to refrain from alcohol and smoking and to take rest. It is mainly because the body needs rest at this time to produce the necessary antibodies to curb this infection. Similarly, after vaccination, the body tries to create antibody against the virus in the body. Hence, do not consume anything that obstruct this process. When people were administered with Sputnik vaccine in Russia, they were advised to stay away from alcohol consumption for two months. The vaccine becomes less effective with alcohol consumption. Second important point is do not smoke for four to five days after vaccination because that too decelerates the antibody production. Smoking reduces our body's immunity as well. Third important point is it is mandatory to sleep for seven to nine hours after getting vaccinated. Depriving the body of sleep is not good. People who work late night need to pay attention to it. The antibody response will be optimal when we sleep well. Fourth point is drink ample amount of water. It helps the antibodies, oxygen and nutrients to reach every part of the body. So drink at least 3 liters of water. That is for every 25 kilogram of the body weight, we must drink 1 liter of water. And finally, the fifth point is people tend to minimize the arm movement after vaccination which is wrong. Movement of arms and limbs are necessary for 4 to 5 days after the vaccination though you must avoid excessive exercise. Another important question whether we can take other medicines like diabetes, blood pressure medicine or any other medicine. You have to continue the medicine as usual even after vaccination. Those medications in no way interact with vaccination because their functioning process is entirely different from each other. So the EMBO mentioned points are very important for better vaccine efficacy and effectiveness. Some people you might have heard they have 200 international unit antibody response while some have only 50 international unit. So high antibody response is required to avoid COVID infection and death. Hence we must try for high antibody response. Apart from that one must take good take care of their body for one week after vaccination. They must avoid consuming all purpose flour products, excessive sugary drinks, processed food. This will ensure optimum effect of vaccination on the body. So kindly share this important information with everyone because many people have several misconceptions regarding this matter that might give away to mistakes. So Dr. D. Better Life will be back again with another good topic. Take care everyone. Kindly share this information to everyone.